The history of craft breweries dates back to 1774 in North Carolina. Atlantic Forklift Services hasn't been around that long, but we have been servicing major craft brewers here in the Charlotte metro area. One of the ways we do this is by providing them with a solution for their application. Most brewers start out big, some start out small. So today we're gonna to review some of the equipment and solutions that can be utilized in the craft breweries. One in particular is a 5,000 pound cushion IC forklift. This obviously will go in and out of trucks for loading and unloading your product and also storing the product in racks. This forklift's capacity is 5,000 pounds and has a large footprint. So ideally you would want open space or clear aisles to utilize this in your brewery. Some cases that doesn't happen, so you have to be very careful when purchasing a lift of this size and capacity for your application. This 5,000 pound forklift is a cushion, so it's utilized inside only. There are options where you can have pneumatic tires on this lift so you can go inside and outside. The low profile mass on this unit would allow you to go inside and outside of a cooler that's got a 96 inch opening and also into a standard truck if you're loading product or unloading materials for use in your brewery. If space is a concern, you would might want to consider the 3,000 pound electric three-wheel forklift. This will operate in a much smaller footprint than the 5,000 pound LP cushion. This also is a cushion forklift, so it can be utilized inside only, but in most cases, that's not an issue. The main factor with this forklift is the size of it. It can turn tighter in aisles and can operate in more confined spaces than its cousin, the 5,000 pound LP. The three-wheel electric will operate much quieter than an LP gas forklift because there's no engine. This may be a factor for you if your storage area or where you're operating the lift is close to your brew pub. If size is really an issue, then you might want to consider an electric pallet jack. This will operate similar to your electric forklift minus the lift. You're only gonna lift about six inches off the ground, which is enough to pick up pallets and move your product through your brewery. This ideally would be used for someone who's got very, very tight space constraints, maybe just starting out, but needs to be able to move their product efficiently and load and unload their product into trucks. This unit comes with a built-in charger and a battery pack, so it makes charging very simple. One other feature on the electric pallet jack is the ability for it to operate in tight spaces. The handle will allow you to pinwheel, so if you're in a tight corner or in the canning area or even in a truck unloading and loading product, this will allow you to do that easily. Last but not least is the manual pallet jack. This will still give you the same functions as the electric pallet jack, but you will have to manually raise and lower the forks. You'll have the same lift height as the jack, but it's gonna be manually powered, meaning you'll have to push it and move it where you want your product to go. This would be used if space is very, very tight. So a craft brewery that's first starting out, that's very limited at their location, this would be ideal for you. This manual jack will handle up to 5,500 pounds, which is more than plenty for moving full kegs of craft beer. This, of course, will limit you into where you can take the jack because it will need a flat level surface to operate and will be under the control by human power. If you have any further questions, please reach out to us. We're here to help.